Hi everyone, happy new year, happy 2024. I'm really happy to 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 say hello to you. And thank you so much for, you know, being with me in different ways. You might have met me or contacted me or joined in my workshop. So I'm really, really happy to welcome you here and to and to say thank you for having trust in me and, you know, looking, you know, following me in, in your ways, in what works best for you. Well done for, it means that if you have met me, if you've gotten in touch with me, it means that you were looking to help yourself. You were looking to support something. You were looking to help, uh, you know, finding more peace and joy within yourself. So I really want to say thank you for doing this because I've done it myself. I chose to feel better myself. And I know that it takes time, it takes courage, it takes you know desire to to be to be you know to feel better and to improve your situation and it's not a journey for everyone you know it's not for everybody so i really want to appreciate and acknowledge your you know your desire to feel better and your desire to feel good and your desire to 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 you know to to face the challenges and the difficulties and the limitation and the struggles you you are experiencing and willing to go and, and explore them and to to find your way through that okay so really 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 I want to you know sort of uh, applaud to you and say well done okay and I say it sincerely I know and I say it with sincerity with integrity so said that uh, I want to share one little thing with you and this it's this Whatever, you know, at New Year's resolution, we all want to have, oh God, I've got, I want to have these, at least in the past, that's what I was doing, you know, okay, oh, I want to, we might want to, okay, I'm going to do, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to run every day from today, from tomorrow, I'm going to run every day, I'm going to, you know, get slimmer, I'm going to be on a diet, I'm going to uh, do that course that I want to do, I'm going to, you know, all these beautiful and positive intentions that every new year's take okay at new year's Eve, we have this beautiful intention and i want to say that this is amazing because it's an energy that is calling you to a greater version of you to a more happier fulfilled uh, you know peaceful version of you so imagine that this call to greatness is 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 your soul okay is your soul let's start talking about that because it's your soul pulling you is your higher self calling you is your heart calling you to 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 move forward and to uh you know meet and expand and evolve and have a greater joy in your life okay because your soul is calling you to a greater joy to a greater fulfillment to more success to more abundance to more love this is what your soul is calling you okay <clears throat> definitely definitely is everything very positive very uplifting it's love it's towards your desire it's your goal okay it's about you feeling happier and being happier but what i want to say as well is that after maybe one two three weeks if you're good you know you're the majority of who you are which is what runs our life, which is our subconscious mind, 95% is run, our life is run by this subconscious mind. So it's this subconscious mind that is powerful because it's, you know, it's run, it's our autopilot, 95% of our life, okay? It's a lot. It's huge. But this subconscious mind, is gonna have such a big power that it's gonna basically take you back to the old place, to the old you, where it's everything is more familiar. You know, you're sitting on the sofa, you're not definitely running. Okay, you are eating instead of whatever diet you want. You are not doing what you wanted. Okay, so of course, it's gonna pull you back to the place where it feels more comfortable because that's where you are used to is familiarity is calling you back to the same familiarity thing you know your subconscious mind doesn't like your mind doesn't like new things it wants to stay comfy in the old habits it's called habits right for a reason okay the thing is that um, the unconscious mind holds all the beliefs that we carry beliefs that for some reason they 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 
your subconscious mind job is to create evidence in your reality that support the belief system. So if I believe that I'm not worthy or I'm not worthy of love, even if a part of me, which is your higher self, wants to have, a, for instance, a partner, okay? Because you know, you know that if you have that partner, you might have a better, you know, you, you want to have that experience. You want to enjoy that love, the sharing. But if that belief system and your subconscious mind has got that belief just inside as a software downloaded in your computer, imagine your subconscious is like a computer, you have, you have downloaded a, so a thought, you have downloaded the software. If that software and that thought and that belief is about, I'm not worthy, I am not worthy of love, guess what? Everything is going to take you back to this because that belief is so strong that it's going to create that reality in your life. That's how we work. That's how powerful we are. Once we understand that everything has to change on this, this subconscious level, we are coming back to take, we are going to take our power back and we can be in control of our life. So my invitation is to think about that, that if you want to change something, that desire is just 5%. But if you really want to change something in your life, you want to have a better job, you want to have a better relationship, you want to have a better health, you want to, whatever you want, and it's just you who knows because it's your soul calling you to a greater place, to a greater version of you. But you have, your job is to go into your subconscious mind and challenge every thought that are in there. You can't, even for money, if you want more money, wow, so many beliefs, limiting beliefs that are in our system, coming from family, coming from the past, coming from the society, coming from the culture. Oh my God, you name it. Your job, my dear friends, and I'm telling you this because I am doing this and I have done that and I'm still doing this, okay? It's not finished. I'm still on my journey. But our job is to challenge you know, go within and challenge and release and remove and change the beliefs that we carry, limitation that we carry, resistant to change that we carry. Okay? Unconsciously, unconsciously. So if you feel like you want this year to take a little bit extra work, to go a little bit deeper and to start, you know, facing a little bit these, these beliefs and start changing these beliefs. One way that I can offer is a one-to-one -one session with me, okay? Because one one-to-one -one session with me or with other therapists, of course, I'm just sharing my, my, my service. Um, it's, it's very, it's much quicker way to, to address, okay? Your beliefs and the beliefs that need to be changed. And we can work with a little bit of you know, subconscious reprogramming. We can work with, with uh, you know, affirmations. But first of all, we need to dig it in and and remove. But we're not digging in with uh, with like with a force. Everything comes very natural. Everything comes very gentle. It's gonna be you, you who are going to show up what needs to be released from you. You are doing the job. You are. We're just. What my job is just to put some light some clean light into the cup. Imagine I've got the cup. My job, imagine this is you, okay? My job is to, and it's not gonna be my water, it's gonna be the water of the divine, the water of life force. I'm just gonna put some clear water inside, you know? I'm just going to put, we're going to put together some clear water, but if there is some, um, you know, some mud underneath, some ground, the water, is going to stir up, you know, some mud. But our job and your job is to carry on putting up the water, carry on, carry on. And we're gonna carry on until all the mud that is gonna go out from this glass. And we're gonna do up to the point, your job and our job, everyone's job is this, to keep on putting water and putting clean water and putting clean light into our cup. Imagine our body, our energy body. We want to put so much water, so much water, so much clean water 
that ultimately, you know, it's gonna be clean. You're gonna be clean, okay? All the mud with gentle, with ease and grace is going to come out, okay? So this is the intention of the healing work. This is the intention of the evolution that we are into this moment. We are here for a reason. We are, you are here to learn the path of self-love. Everyone is here to learn and to become awakened. Everyone is here to connect with source, to connect with spirit. We can't, um, everyone is here to learn the truth. Everyone is here to awaken to the reality that you are an amazing being. We are all an amazing being and we are all connected. We are in the same path, but this is an evolution, you know, and we are here to face the challenges, face the fears, face the blockages, remove the blockages and step into our greatness. This, this, is, a, this is where we, we are meant to do that, okay? And it's about self-love, compassion. It's, we need to bring that energy in. Everything happens uh, you know, for a reason, embrace the the journey, knowing that everything happens for your highest good, because we are living in a benevolent world, in a benevolent universe. So even if you're struggling, even if you can't find a way out, be reassured that within yourself, you know that there is light. You know that. Okay, you know that. It's a knowingness that you, I know you know. Okay, so what might our job together is going to be to remember it more remember it more and by you remembering that lie that is you you're going to you know you're going to to shine because all all the mud is going to slowly slowly coming out layer by layer taking its own time but it's going to coming out the egg is going to be open from the inside not from the outside it's not going to be an outside so force breaking the egg is the inside force that is going to break the egg gently, okay? With its own time, divine time again, okay? So we want to just get into that inner power, that inner light, and that inner light, connecting with source, connecting with the higher spirit, connecting with your higher self, connecting with your intuition, connecting with your wisdom, with the love you are, is going to do the job for you, okay? And uh, yes, so if you want, uh, again, we can have a... Um, a one-to-one -one session together and said that I'm going to do uh, in February a workshop, new workshop, and it's going to be about manifestation, okay? Because we need to start getting into that, uh, yeah, we are here to master energy. We are here to learn how to master energy and we are here and we need, we are here to learn how to create because we are creator. Either you realize it or not, you are creating your own reality, okay? If your reality, you, you have experience you, you know, you don't like, the, the truth is that you are crea creating it, okay? So let's start taking the power back. Let's start creating what you really want, <laughs> okay? Let's start becoming aware of what you want to create. Hmm? Because either you realize it or not, your life has been created by you, okay? Whatever you're experiencing. So let's start understanding the mechanism and so you can take the power back and so you can create what you really want, okay? Whatever it is for you. So I'm going to do that. It's going to be in February. I still have to decide the date. It's going to be one in Italian and one in English and uh, manifestation so creating your 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 reality what better month than january and sorry than than february and to be honest it's gonna be february around the chinese uh, um, chinese new year and is this year is the year of the dragon okay so it's a powerful year very powerful it's about taking action it's about abundance it's about uh, it's it's number eight it's a number eight infinite wow so many but beautiful beautiful uh, it's gonna be a beautiful 2024 here ahead okay so just leave you with that and i'll see you soon i send you a big hug thank you again for being with me for this many time this long 15 minutes <laughs> of blah 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 and i send you big love and again let's start taking our power back little by little 
okay be patient our own time we are supported we are not alone you are not alone okay we're all together in this see you soon